connections and your friends. The Bible says it's appointed for man to die once and after that judgment. Ladies and gentlemen, if you look at Revelation chapter 20 verse 4, it says that those who die, those who sacrifice themselves, those who live a life of Christ are rewarded. But those who live a life of sin are judged. One thing that actually makes me angry is that when God made the lake of fire, it was an intention to put the devil and his minion in the lake of fire. But as we see it, the place was made for the devil, but human beings went there first before the devil. If you are smart, you must see how the devil is making you do his bidding and getting banned for it. Literally. Today, it's a chance for you to reconcile with Christ or reconcile with God through Christ. Don't, don't listen to my accent. Don't, listen to, don't look at me to make decisions. Just hear that word. Just hear it. Allow it to enter your spirit. Allow it to enter your spirit. Hear it. And ask yourself right now, if the trumpet sounded and Jesus Christ decided to divide us, the sheep from the goat, the chaff from the wheat, where will you stand? Which part of the group It does not matter whether you believe it or not. It does not matter that I have not spoken to you in a way that makes you comfortable. It does not matter. My word, my job is to give you the word. My job is to tell you. Don't look at the way I have delivered it. Don't kill the messenger. The word has come to you. You cannot stand before the throne of God because when you stand there and we are doing the judgment, you see my face there. And when you say, Jesus, I, I didn't hear about you, I'll say, hey, man, man, I told you, I saw you. You came on my Facebook page. You came to church. You came on YouTube. You heard it right. You just didn't like the delivery. Don't make this thing personal. It's not. It's personal for you and your Christ, not about me and you. If you hear his voice, do not harden your heart, my friend. Because he has died on the cross just for you and for me. And for such a time as this, that we might have the chance to be redeemed by him. I want you to pray with me wherever you are in the name of Jesus. King of kings, we give you praise, almighty God. We glorify your holy name. We say that there is no God, there is no power, there is no one like unto you, Lord Jesus. We say that your name is Yahweh, your name is lifted beyond and above every other name, for there is no name like unto you. You are faithful, you are true, Lord. Your word says that you are coming and you will come. Because your word was foretold that you will come and you came. All that I now, Lord, in the name of Jesus, and all that I have, we come before you, Lord, I lay them down that you strengthen our faith, you, O Lord. O Lord. You help us to see you and your kingdom. The Lord, our saints are mad. But your love is great. We humble ourselves before you. We say, Lord, forgive our sins. And our sinful ways. Lord, our iniquity are beyond our reach. But your faithfulness is in us. Touch our heart. Speak to us. Lord, revive our spirit that we may see.
Let your presence and your grace abound in us. Lord, I offer you my life. Mighty name of Jesus, every spirit of the enemy, every power of darkness, every deceit of the enemy, every ways of the enemy, every territorial spirit, every sicknesses, every disease, wishes and dreams that are yet Every plans of the enemy against the people of God as they hear the sound of my voice. In the name of, of Jesus, my I command them to bow to the name in of my hands. I command them to bow to and you. lose their control and lose their hope. Lord, in the name of Jesus, I strip them of every authority. You. Everything I walk been over them through. in the name of Jesus. Use Let there be a healing. Your Let there be a grace. Let there be a salvation. Let there be the power of God. Let there be the presence of God. Let there be a deliverance. Every power, every spirit that is tormenting the people of God, causing them in substance abuse, idolatry, adultery, every power of the enemy, confusion of the enemy, anything that the devil is using to abuse the children of God. Today I command you to be gone in Jesus. Not already yours. You said all power has been given unto all us. All we in possess and earth. are these we lives. We're living, and that's that what we, we give. 